My name is David. Um, this is Yvonne, and we have an eco dog called Scruff. Our dog Scruff likes to pick bottles up off the floor. He likes to play with them and then bring them back to us. We kick them about a bit, and then when he drops them and seems not interested anymore, we'll put them in a bag ready to bring home. We wasn't counting the numbers in 2021. It was just it was just purely pick them up. Um, that's what prompted us prompted us to start counting. Um, at the beginning of the 22. Seeing the amount of litter about really, and when he'd pick one up in 2021, carry it a while and then put it back down, it seemed wrong that we'd leave it because it wasn't our litter. Um, so yeah, we started bringing it home and then said that we'd keep them for the year and count them up. We think we're on about a thousand-ish at the moment, or scuffs on about a thousand-ish at the moment. Lots of people say he looks so cute when he's walking along. Um, you know, a couple of people have said he should be employed by the council. Um, but no, everybody seems to just love Scruff. It's shocking to see what is out there once you properly open your eyes to it. I think he's 13 and probably the first 10, 11 years of his life he just walked past and yes, he picked the odd bottle up and dropped it again. Just didn't think anything mm. of it. But now that we're actually looking, and he'll even go up to cans or glass bottles, but he doesn't pick them up. We don't allow him to, it's dangerous. Um, and you think the amount it's of litter everywhere. Is lots. Yeah. Mm, there's yeah. a lot more litter on the streets. We'll never was. let him just drop one again come next year. It'll be, if he's picked it up, we'll put it in the bin. If we walk the same route every day, he will find bottles on that same route every day. There's litter every day on the same route. So I think that just puts it down to people are chucking litter. I've, not, I've never seen not people dropping litter while we're out walking the dog anyway. You see people drop litter when you're driving past maybe and things like that. I don't know, I was brought up like never to drop litter. The mum used to give us a clip. If you were, you know, you're, not, you're taught not to drop litter. Um, so something's changed in society somewhere, isn't it? When, when you <coughs> walk to route and then you see them all again and you think if we weren't picking them up, how long would they stay there? Yeah. yeah. So you feel a bit of pride that we are picking them up, but a bit of anger as well that they're even there. I would guess that there's a lot of people out there whose dogs do Already enjoy do picking up a plastic bottle, the noise, the chewing on the it, throw in. the throwing. So yeah, it'd be great if somebody decided that the same as us, they'd actually put them in a bin after they finished playing with them. If, so, yeah, if... As, if... I mean, there was once upon a time where when Scuff picked a bottle up, we didn't pick it up after him. It weren't until it triggered in our mind to, to start bringing them home because we felt guilty leaving them in the end. So if everybody just decided to do that, they'd stop, or stop dropping litter. More to the point, we're better than picking them up, stop dropping it. Mm. Be more Scruff. Yeah. <laughs>